Here are the 13 pieces that have been 3D printed for our plotter. They're printed in a somewhat brittle plastic, so we'll have to be a little careful in handling the parts. Just to cover what the parts are, before we put everything together, we have these four pieces, one, two, three, four, are the control arms that will move back and forth, and this one in particular will hold the dry erase pen. This piece here will hold the lower servos that move back and forth left and right, and it will be connected to a third servo that you'll see later that will tilt these two servo holders up and down, which will cause the pen to lift up and down. This is a support piece for these two. This piece here is the holder of the dry erase pen cap, which will also serve as our board eraser. This is for our third servo that makes the left-right servos move up and down, and this is the control arm for that. This piece here at the top is a vertical piece for the table of the plotter, and this will be our main surface that you'll see when we put all the parts together. I'll go step by step and show what I did so that I can have the whole clock um, working well with all the holes drilled and some need to be tapped so that a screw can thread into them. And I'll show that step by step. 